Hi Sagittarius, welcome back to Self Discovery Support. And today we're going to be looking at their thoughts, feelings, and potential actions of the person that you're thinking of. Could be a connection, could be romantic, but it doesn't necessarily have to be. It's just the person that you're in some connection where there's an energy which is tied up to you and <clears throat> you're, yeah, you're thinking a lot about them. All right. So let's get straight into it. I want to find out the energy of the connection in general. <laughs> Not even a question in. Five of Cups. Okay. So, you know, this came out so deliberately. I feel like this is your card. So, Five of Cups. <clears throat> yeah. Energy of this connection is loss. It's difficult, right? There's some kind of missed opportunity here. Something that you, I guess you're not seeing also. the good, the good Let's say not the good sides, but the things to be thankful for, right? There's something that in this connection we're focusing on. You could be in, if you're in a connection actively with this person, maybe we're focusing too much on the the negative aspects, the things that don't make us feel good, the things we've lost rather than what we actually have. If you're not, then potentially this is about someone separated, someone who's left or some kind of loss in some way. All right, so let's clarify that. Nine of Wands, so real kind of someone's not going to give up on this connection. Someone who's feeling the loss is definitely not going to give up. Okay. So why is the Five of Cups here for Sagittarius? Why is it here for Sag? This came out first. The world. Eight of Cups. Queen of Cups. So, a lot of cups here, right? There's a lot of emotion on the table. But a lot of unfulfilled, dissatisfactory, sad energy connected to this. Some cycle needed to be completed. So someone left. And I feel it's this Queen of Cups that left. The connection. Someone. Yeah, someone who is very loving. Very sweet. Okay, so there's there's some kind of commitment that couldn't quite take place. There's some commitment that you're having to wait on. Hmm. Give me one more. King of Wands. So we saw our Queen of Cups. We have... And now we have a Queen of Pentacles. Okay, so we have all sorts of people... And personalities popping up in this um, reading already. So this is, you know, this is fire energy here. You know, fire sign energy. So this could be you. This could be you that's walking, trying to close a cycle. And trying to... We did see the Queen of Cups, so we do think that the memory, the loss here is about a Queen of Cups, but you could be walking away from a Queen of Pentacles. Okay, no, I think the energy here is that you're actually trying to work on something with a Queen of Pentacles, yeah. Okay. Hmm, but I do, see, I do feel that you're... There's two energies here. There's two feminine energies and there's your energy. Um, this could be, you know, female, male. It, it 
doesn't really make the difference. I, I think it's just about different energies. So there are three different energies here. Um, yeah. There's at least two energies, right? <laughs> Your reading is totally... Someone, someone wants to close a cycle. Yeah, someone wants to close a cycle because they're feeling such a loss. A loss of someone's presence. And they're in search of something else. They're, this person, either you or your, your person that you're thinking of, is trying to act in a more kind of kind of definitive way like this is the knowing i know what i have lost and i know what i want to go towards now and so therefore i have to take those actions okay i want to see what are other energies here what are the other energies why is there this five of cups Yeah, why is the why is the five of cups here? Or oh, what's causing this five of cups? Let's see what's causing this five of cups. What caused? Okay, so we have our our ship and dog. So there's something about. Yeah, I don't think the I don't think the universe wants to tell me what's causing it. I think it wants to focus on the fact that somebody is going towards something that they feel is a safer place. Like they're wanting to, they want to be in a place that they they trust. They feel more comfortable. Yeah, I I feel like this is what we're being asked to focus on here, not why someone walked away. I feel like, yeah, I, I feel that there is some uh, lack of clarity in this situation that is attached to this five of cups, this mournfulness, this regret. There wasn't enough clarity to create safety. Yeah. All right, so I want to find out your um, your energy, how you think about this connection. How does for Aries, for Sagittarius, for Sagittarius? You know, I mentioned Aries because this reading is so similar. For because you're both um, fire signs, so it's gonna have this a similar link. Um, four of cups, your energy, so. You might be the one thinking that these things didn't happen the way that you thought. Maybe you're not seeing an opportunity. So here we have a missed opportunity and here you're not seeing, seeing an opportunity. There's something about not repeating mistakes. You don't, <laughs> you're quite conflicted about something. Five of Wands, Five of Swords again. Okay. I say again because I'm saying I, I just did um, a reading. I think it's Aries that had this. Five, Five. Change and Conflict. I feel that you want to communicate about any kind of defeat, any kind of fighting. You just want to, yeah. I feel like you want to clear that up. You want to have a new start. Because you don't want to let go of something. Or are you holding things in? You're holding yourself back from speaking a truth. There's something, there might be a situation you're going through. You might be going through a period where you're, you're, you're going back to your spirit guides, your, your kind of sense of connection to the universe. To kind of find answers. Let's find out why. The four of cups is there. Why is our four of cups here? For Sagittarius. 
Ten of Cups. Okay, so you feel you haven't had a chance to, to have this happiness in this connection. Tell us more. <laughs> Hidden Energy. So there's a lot of deep thought about this, a lot of thinking. You're thinking all the time, like, this is not this is just not what I wanted to happen it, we just didn't get a chance all right tell us more about this four of cups justice this justice card has been coming up for everybody now at the beginning of the year everybody's balancing scales universe is balancing a whole lot for people yeah look at that six of wands I feel that you want, because I feel like you feel cheated from having this happiness in this connection. And this is what you want now. You you want that balance. You want that fairness. Tell us more. Oh, that flew out with. <laughs> Did you see that? I just looked up an eleven eleven on the um the timer. So we have a number of manifestation and. What flew out <laughs> with like the speed of lightning to a cups? Okay, so I feel this is your energy. I feel like you're feeling quite deserted. You're feeling alone, separated, not in the warmth and grace of this connection anymore. And you just feel like, no, I want the happiness. I don't want this situation i don't want to miss a chance anymore i'm gonna what i want is to have what i know can happen i know that we can come into to harmony i know that whatever happened i don't feel it was fair yeah and i feel like i pray for karmic balance to bring union in something all right so then this is not telling me of someone that walked away this could be this could be because there is that five of pentacles but so let's see on your person's side for Sagittarius their connection what is Sagittarius is person thinking. What is Sagittarius is person thinking about this connection? A star. Okay. So that's quite nice. Your person thinks that this can be healed. This can be repaired. This might actually be wish or a hope for some balance to come. The fool. So they're 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 willing to have a new beginning. Okay. So there's a lot of hope here. I'm really happy with that. Because we just had a couple other readings that were, you know, quite sad, quite down. Alright, so tell us why the star is here. Seven of Pentacles. Okay, so your person is willing to work. On this they're willing to take the time needed to invest okay high priestess your person is really in tune with their their um, intuition and seven of swords though why is there a seven of swords here there's something sneaky there's some sneakiness is someone sneaky, sneaking off or strategizing how to come up with some kind of apology in order to have a new start? Hmm. Okay. Tell us more. Tell us more. The hanged man. Okay. So your person is being patient. There's a lot. There's two cards here about patience. I feel like your person is in a state of healing as well. Now that I am seeing all the cards, look at that. Four of Swords. Yeah. There could not be another card oh, that fell off showing the Nine of Wands. 
this has taken a toll. This connection has taken a big toll on your person. It's This has been ongoing. And your person is taking the, the time to just kind of take a break, repair, heal. Think about all of this. Three cards that tell us about just waiting, healing, coming back to center. All right, one more. All right, it doesn't want to be one more. It wants to be two more. Okay, so I feel like your person is, they might be a little bit defensive now, you know, if at this point, but I feel like they are, they are wanting to, to have things change. Yeah, I feel that. I feel that how they feel about the connection is they are willing to work at it, but they, they needed to take a break we saw five of um five of pentacles somewhere on your side your energy so we know that you are feeling a little bit kind of left out so your person has kind of retreated to heal some things the chariot though so yeah it tells me that whatever your person is doing here is is actually even though it feels like they're separated they're away they've turned their back this is actually allowing momentum towards Ten of Pentacles. I couldn't plan that. This just appeared. Yeah. This is actually, it doesn't seem like it, but your person needed time to heal. You needed time to see the happiness and the, the, the balance that you wanted to have in this and the union and connection. And I guess you both needed time to miss this, to understand that it was a, a missed opportunity to close out cycles. Yeah, and to really, to really feel the passion and need to, to achieve what it is that you would like to stand up for it. And moving on from something yeah. What's blocking? Oh, why is the five of cups here is what we asked, right? I feel that this person is, there's, you know, if you could get over this, there's such a, a strong bond that's possible. We have the dog here. That's real faith and trust and loyalty between two and coming together yeah okay I want to get um, a next steps advice for you yeah what are the next steps for Sagittarius for Sagittarius what are the advised next steps for Sagittarius Half the deck came out. Two. Okay, we have the lovers. And we have nine of cups. And king of swords in hidden energies. So we have something about speaking honestly. Speaking truthfully. Respect. Communicating clearly. And we have about something here, Nine of Cups, wishes coming true, your dreams become reality, a magical time of life, good fortune, faith in the universe that all will be well. So on your side, Sagittarius, I do see that you saw this as a missed opportunity. I do see that you didn't want this and you want balance to bring things back into union. Um, it's knowing that embracing true love and deep intimate friendships make choices from the heart 
vibrant health or recovery from an illness. So I think the illness here is um, missed, missing someone dear to you. Yep, it's, 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 to me, it's been like you've gone through something, but it's been, it's, to me, I see an upturn in what's about to happen. I see that this could be writing itself. Okay, and I think it's about making time for this person to go through what they go through, or what they are going through, but yeah. The lovers here and the two of cups, like, this to me is clearly a love connection. It's not a, this is more than the normal connection. The lovers, nine of cups, ten of cups, two of cups, on your side, so much love. And, yeah. But your person is also in a place where they are, they are feeling that this can be brought back. Yeah. So there you go, Sagittarius. This is your reading. If you enjoyed, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you back here again. And wishing you a good week, day, month, year. Okay, take care.